Hello, I'm Martin Davison, Forest Commission Ornithologist. Uh, we've just come back from an exciting time. We've just been to, to ring the, um, the first two broods of um, ospreys. The first nest we went to is the, uh, the new nest, the second nest we have at Kielder here. And uh, it's got two chicks. Um, one is about five weeks old, so it's quite large and bouncy. But its sibling is a good week or so younger, if not even smaller than that. So one was big and bouncy, and the other one was quite down covered and somewhat subdued. Um, it's really exciting to have the second nest, as with the first nest, it, you know, to have two self colonizing pairs within the Fumberland is really ex exciting. And um, hopefully, this will be a start of a colonization which will continue for many years, as the county can hold, I'm quite certain, many, many pairs, you know, 30 plus, I would think, no problem at all in due course. Um, the second nest went to, which is the original nest, unfortunately only got one chick this year, but she, he or she is extremely big and bouncy, and is probably about 14 days-ish older than the other, of the other, and then the other nests. So that bird will, will go on and fledge sometime in early August, and the other nest will probably fledge mid-August. The ospreys, after fledging, will have to fend for themselves. So they fledge, and for the first fortnight or so, they are taught to fish by the parents. But because these nests are quite late, um, these birds have to be on the way by early September to Africa. So these birds are going to have to learn in double-quick time.